because they don't know what to say. They don't understand the language or artist sales. They haven't read great books like Tom's book or exactly what to say or pull out the old Tommy Hopkins book from the 80s. People don't change, Tommy. right? They don't change. Those books will teach you the principles and the language of sales and psychology. And if you can like master those, you're going to know more than at least 90% of the realtors out there because they just don't bother. You've got to study your craft. You've got to study your trade. Those are the people that are going to win in the years coming up. So this is a question I ask on almost every episode of this podcast so far. And I don't, I know you haven't had to answer this question. What's the right avatar coaching client for you? Don, you or do you first? have one? Hmm? I do. <sighs> That perfect avatar. I'm asked this. I, I love working with everybody, but I guess the perfect avatar, number one, has to be growth minded. If we're just, I mean, Dave, Dave just talked about it. Why are we talking about the same thing over and over, right. getting the same answers over and over, no actions being taken? If that's you, we're probably not going to spend a lot of time together. Um, besides that, it's the 20 to 30 deal a year producer looking to start building that small team. And then even beyond that, that small team, and Dave will appreciate this, wanting to go big into a uber profitable team. Do we go small or really step into that 15, 20, 50 agent realm and go big? Um, the puzzle pieces that come with each of those are fascinating to me. And I love that about coaching. All right. So, uh, 